Hi everyone, this is my entry for NTNA Season 7 Pre-Challenge 2, sponsored by Swarovski Crystals. I was especially excited to work on this project as I was very identified with my given style, the Crystal Lover. I wanted to create a set that was both classy and sophisticated but also full of bling for the true Crystal Lover. I started out by extending and building my nails over press-ons. This will allow for easy removal and reapplication. That way, I'll be able to wear them over and over again. In order to complement my design with the gorgeous sparkle that all Swarovski sort of crystals have, I chose a subtle palette for a more classy look. And to make the crystals stand out even more, I use them to create embellishments. Wait until the end so you can see the reveal. I love a good set of nails that turns heads. The crystals make for a perfect addition to any set elevating the design. It's all about the crystals. In order to create this marbly effect, make sure to dilute some gel paint with nail cleanser and apply it on a top coated nail. I wanted my design to be dynamic by utilizing different techniques. These techniques give different effects that catch the light from every angle and make for a more eye-catching look. For this embellishment, Start off by dipping some crystal pixies into a self-leveling builder gel. Add petals one layer at a time, and after a few layers, you'll end up with an encapsulated rose. Be patient, it'll all be worth it. Create some petals with 4D gel and attach them to the embellishment to create a more realistic look. Don't forget to add Swarovski crystals for a more elevated look. Any crystal lover would love some jewelry illusion and Swarovski crystals are the perfect product to create this look. It's like little jewelry for your nails! When doing full crystal nails, it's important to add some glitter in the background to help fill in any empty spaces. Doing this will give the design a more polished look. For this embellishment, start off with some uncured builder gel and apply foil on it. Cure it and remove the foil afterwards. Look at that! It's a little necklace! For this design, I'm using acrylic and embossing gel to add texture to the rose and swirls without adding bulk. I wanted the crystals to be the center of attention for this set. And I think I got it! Or what do you think? Here's the reveal! Special thanks to Swarovski Crystals for sponsoring this challenge! And thank you so much for watching!